Hey guys, welcome to my first YouTube video. I'm so excited. Anyway, this channel is going to be, um, I don't know what it's going to be yet. Mainly, I know I want to take a look at men's clothing from a more design perspective. We'll see as I make more videos and I get better at this and, you know, you guys give me your opinions. I know you all have a lot of those. Today I have this jacket. It is by a company called Profound Aesthetic. I have some opinions, so let's talk. Number one. The colors are all wrong. I don't like the white right here and on the back. So it looks really, uh, I don't know, it looks like they just gave up on choosing a color so they're like, oh, let's just put white in. The white is already getting dirty and I don't wear this in any situation where the white would be getting dirty. I've only worn it like, I, like I said, like nine times or something like that. See like the inside. And I'm a clean person so I don't know why it's dirty like that, it's stupid. It has a zipper on it, it has a, a YKK zipper, which are these fancy zippers that some brands like to put on their clothes. Um, it zips up okay uh, for the fanciness of the zipper. If you're gonna tell me what zipper it, it is, it shouldn't get stuck like this, and it does that often, and it makes this terrible noise. It says on their website that this is a parka. It's not a parka. Parkas are made of fur um, and have a hood, generally. This is just a windbreaker at best. I don't know if it's even breaking wind. Oh, this has no hood, unless I'm losing my mind. Um, and this thing is kind of floppy, and I, I don't know. It doesn't sit like this. There's no ribbing or any sort of structure in, in this to make it kind of sit around your neck like a turtleneck would. It just kind of is there. Um, these have don't have aglets. For all of you Phineas and Ferb watchers out there, you guys know what an aglet is just tied off at the end. It's 100% polyester, so all plastic all the way, which I don't, if you like that, I don't know. Screen printing on the front is actually really good. Um, it's not direct to garment, it looks like. It looks like it was actually like screen printed on there, so it's kind of, you can feel the, the change where the ink got put on, which is, I like. I, I think that's really good. The sleeves, are kind of already fraying on the, the seams, which I kind of think is normal after a while, but again, I haven't worn this that many times, so I kind of feel like that's, it's kind of wearing a little soon. Overall, I would not recommend this jacket. Don't buy it. I mean, it's $88, so now it's kind of like, oh, this is cool, cool accessory piece. Just, mm, it was a waste of money. Let's be honest here. I wish I had gotten something maybe that would actually keep me warm throughout all the seasons, I like to wear like just set clothes. Um, so I like to just be able to feel like I can throw anything on at any time throughout the year. Not my favorite thing I ever bought, but they have a really good company. And there's the, a lot of the stuff they make is really good. If I were to rate it like a four out of 10, is that gonna be my rating scale? I don't know, we'll see as these videos progress. Next time, hopefully I'll show you something that I would buy but I don't know what that is. You'll see in the next video. If you like this video, please like and subscribe. If you didn't like this video, well, I don't know why. So, you know, maybe you should still like and subscribe and maybe you'll start liking them more. The more you see me, the more we get to know each other. You, we could be best friends, you know. That's it for this video. Thank you guys so much for watching and I can't wait to do another one. Bye guys.